President Muhammad Buhari at the opening session of the 16th Conference of the Committee of Intelligence and Security Services of Africa, Siska in Abuja, called on the intelligent community in Africa to tighten the loop against illicit financial flows, just as he attributed rising security challenges to sponsorship by those who profit from illegal financial activities. A United Nations report, and I quote, on illicit financial flows and the problems of net resources transferred from Africa 1980 to 2009, unquote, observed that during the period 1980 to 2009, between 1.2 trillion United States dollars and 1.4 trillion United States dollars was taken out of Africa. This figure is half of the current cross domestic product of all the countries of Africa. As partners in the fight against crime and insecurity, you know that terrorist networks, organized criminal syndicates of drugs, arms, and human traffickers, and sundry hostile non-state actors are actively undermining the security and stability of our countries. These criminal groups not only fund their operation from the proceeds of crime, but are implicated in much of the illicit financial outflows from Africa. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, firm and unwavering action is required to bring this threat under control. Any evasion of rules and regulations in ways that aid corruption in its various manifestations, including illicit financial outflows, must be vigorously fought and defeated. My role as African Union's anti-corruption champion brought me closer to appreciating more devastating impact of corruption and illicit financial outflows on our continent. I am therefore pleased that this conference will boost the sense of urgency that we collectively have about this devastation and raise our response capacity at operational levels. In Nigeria, we have risen to the, to the challenge. The fight against corruption remains at the core of our efforts to accelerate national development. We have recorded successes, even though the perpetrators are not giving up and are trying to fight back.